Alright everybody, it's time for some Minecraft. It's really early, so my voice is kind of deeper than normal. Anyway, it's time for some Minecraft, and today I'm doing another tutorial because I figured out how to do some simpler um, redstone. Uh, you guys remember the uh, lockable door from L Games that he, he showed us and we were... We just loved, right? So then you, you lock it, you walk out, and you can't walk back in. Oh no! Right? I love this little thing. But, I thought maybe that that was a little bit, you know, this is a little bit small. I mean, the version he had was a little bit long. And that's not bad, it's just a little bit longer. So I've been working on how to make it smaller. And I found something that I really think would help a lot to make it smaller. So let's go over here to a nice open space, right? And let's give ourselves some piston doors. And then, now you might remember he had something like... Something like that or something. I don't remember exactly how he had it. Right? But watch this. That. Right there. Just that one torch does the exact same thing. As long as you have a block there. Kudunk. Does the exact same thing. Which is really nice. Alright. Because then, you know, you don't have to... You, you don't have to do a lot of things, you know, that it, it becomes a whole lot smaller. Okay, so once you've got that one one torch in place, all you need to do, whoops, get rid of that, is run your line to each torch, right? And then under there, connects to that guy. Plug in those guys, it opens. And now, we need to plug in this door. Now, if you only plug in this door to one side, like that, then you can put this here, and you can put this, the lock mechanism, right here, And it's a little bit simpler. And then you build up your house a little. And let's say, let's put our door. I forgot a lever. Oh, now I don't have that torch anymore. And I need that torch. We put the lever here, right? That could be problematic right there, that door. But that's easy to fix. Oops. You just go like this. And then... Oh, man. I always do this. I always screw up when I'm trying to show you guys how to do it. So, let's just go like this. So you need it there, right? So I guess we can just do it like this. So you just gotta finagle around the machine you've already set up until it works. <laughs> okay. But on it worked. So, all in all, it isn't a whole ton smaller, but it is a little smaller, which means you can put it into a house a little bit simpler. And it uh, just 
means you can you can implement it Im implement it that much faster because now it doesn't take quite as long to build either and so it's still it still is pretty long on the one side you know we've got the one two what is this one two three four five five blocks of space on this right hand side of the our door and then we've got one two three four blocks of space on the other side but it works it's a tiny bit simpler redstoning um, so hope that helped um, hope that gave you some ideas I guess if I was gonna make this house I'd put it up here you know but anyway I now I'm just kind of rambling and kind of ramble building but let's just close this guy like this and then go like that and there you go, that's this whole machine all closed up nice and nice and simple, like really small. And you can make it, this one looks like it's a little bit smaller. So over here. So you can make it pretty small. It does, it does work out pretty small sometimes. And uh, there you go. Hope you learned something, hope you enjoyed. Have a good one. This is Glorfi signing out. Don't break too much.